on, just your voices. Release the fullness of your spirit. Come on, just ask him. Shekinah glory come. Shekinah glory come. Release the fullness of your spirit, Lord. Shekinah glory come. Shekinah glory come. Come on again. Release the fullness of your spirit. Shekinah glory come. Shekinah glory come. Release the fullness of your spirit. Shekinah glory come. Shekinah glory come. Come on, say, when you move, when you move, we want more. You speak, we want more. You move, we want more. We want the fullness. You move, we want more. You speak, we want more. You move, we want more. We want the fullness, so release the fullness of your spirit. Shekinah glory come, Shekinah glory come, release the fullness of your Shekinah glory come. Come on, somebody just bless the Lord in this place. Let's lift him up today. Worship you. Worship you. Come on, how many just want more of him today? Come on, I invite you one more time just to lift your hands up to the Lord. Father, with our hands lifted high, Lord, we bless your holy name in this place, God. Lord, throughout this broadcast, we ask that you just pour out your spirit in this place and let your glory just flow over us tonight, Lord. As we sing one more time, release, release the fullness of your spirit. Shekinah glory come, yes Lord. Shekinah glory come, release the fullness of your spirit. Shekinah glory come, Shekinah glory come. Oh, we bless you, Lord. Bless your holy name, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Holy Ghost is in this place. And we know that the Holy Ghost is in your home, wherever you're at. If you've been worshiping with us, you can feel the presence of the Lord because he's here right now and he's blessing this time together. I want to just make a quick note. For those of you that are watching on Bodybuilders TV, you're going to be uh, prompted to go to a pay-per-view on-demand button to push there. And the, the pay-per-view money that you pay tonight will go towards our $25,000 goal for Liberia. So we ask you to, to please stay with us and continue with us because we have a great event lined up for you tonight. Well, hallelujah. Without further ado... Our host for tonight's event, they are pastors of Embassy Global Church of God in Christ, founders of Embassy Global Ministry Network, founders of Bodybuilders Television Network, 
publishers of Harambe magazine and missionaries to Liberia since 2004. Dr. W.C. Chambliss III and Dr. Brenda Miller Chambliss are as they are going to be recognized globally as the host of their new show, Bodybuilders TV with Will and Brenda. Please welcome Dr. Will and Dr. Brenda Chambliss to the stage. Hallelujah. Let's give them a hand. Well, somebody say praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Oh, he is worthy to be praised. I'm Dr. W.C. Chambliss III, and this is my lovely wife. I'm Dr. Brenda Miller Chambliss, hereafter be known as... Will. And Brenda. And Brenda. Amen. And for those of you that are here and those of you that are watching all around the world, let me tell you, I'm tired. <laughs> I tell you what, it's something doing this live, people, amen. To those of you that are watching, just got a phone call. Evangelist Jerry Thompson watching in Toronto. Pastor Moses is watching us in Monrovia, Liberia. And she could not be here with us tonight. We need to pray with her for her mother, Miss uh, Doreen Weatherby uh, from Best Nets. But she is watching us live. Hello, Doreen. Hello, Doreen. God bless you. And we're praying for your mother. And all those that are watching all around the world and those of you that are here, I tell you what, we are excited to be here on tonight for what God is doing. This is our first live taping of Will and Brenda. And when we come on, our theme now is it's a new season because most of you are used to seeing me in front of the camera and Dr. Chamlin is not really even seeing him because he's been behind the camera. Hiding back in the back. But in something the happened about a year or so ago. Yeah. And in the, in the words of uh, uh, Whoopi Goldberg in the movie uh, Color Purple, I's married now. So it's no longer Brenda. It's now Will, Will and, and Brenda. Brenda. And you and, know what, baby? I want to say this ooh, on the camera. Baby. All over the world. Doesn't she look good? She looks good. Come oh, on, I didn't put hear your that. hands together. Doesn't she look good? <laughs> hey, man, I'm, I'm, I'm not just sweating because I'm hot. I'm sweating because she looks good. <laughs> Amen. Bless the Lord. Listen on tonight, for those of you that are watching and tuning in, we thank you for those that are sewing in to the ministry on tonight. We're going to be sharing about, as we launch Global Vision 2020, our empowerment yes. mission to Liberia. Mm -hmm. Listen, people, we are so blessed. I would almost say that the poorest person in the United States is richer than people in Liberia. Missions is a powerful thing and it's a powerful need. And we encourage you on tonight to watch, to stay tuned, and to keep viewing as we share on tonight. You know, um, praise and worship, a powerful, powerful praise and worship, Brother Adam Benedict, amen. And the praise team back there, amen. Come on, give me a little more of that Shekinah glory come. I tell you that, I felt that. Amen. Come on, those of you that are at home, that just come on, lift your hands. Lift your hands and magnify. Come on, lift your hands and magnify the name of Jesus on tonight. Because God is worthy. Yes, he's worthy to be praised. Come on, release right now. Come on, release the Those of you that are home, somebody has a need right now. Whatever you're going through, there is no problem that God cannot solve. There's not a question that he doesn't have an answer to. I want you to know on tonight, God is in control. He is in control. Oh, this isn't a taping. We're capturing. We're capturing the presence. We're capturing the anointing. Amen. Glory to God. You know, in the Bible, when God did something, they would build an altar. Yes. If you go over Jerusalem all over, you see it. You may think it's just a rock. 
You may think it's just a bump, but that was an altar because something happened there. See, somebody is looking at you and they may think you're just a bump. <laughs> they may think you're just a log. Oh, but they don't know the testimony that something happened to you. They don't know that, hey, I'm a walking, living testimony. Something happened here. Something happened here. Amen. Amen. I can't get enough. I can't get enough, Adam. Oh, I, I can't, can't get, get enough, enough yes. of your presence, Oh, God. yes. Hallelujah. Oh, Hallelujah. I can't get enough. Can't Hallelujah. Get Come enough. on right now. Come on. I can't, can't get, get enough, enough of your presence. 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 Can't get enough of your presence. Presence. I can't get enough of your oh, presence. Oh, come on. More of the Lord. Presence. Come on. I can't get enough. Can't get enough. Oh, I can't get enough of your presence. Presence. I can't get enough of your presence. Presence. I can't get enough of your presence. Those of you that are watching right now, if there is a need that you have, you can email us. Go to our contact form right on that website right now. Email us. Our intercessors will get those prayer requests. We'll be interceding. I see intercessors. She's shaking her head right now. We're, we're praying. We're standing in prayer. Believing God. Believing God for the healing. Believing God as we're touching. Amen. Amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Somebody say thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, the presence of the Lord is here right now. The presence, hallelujah, the presence of the Lord is here right now. Hallelujah. Pastor Shep, he's here right now. Amen. Sister Howard, he's here right now. Amen. He's here right now. Glory to God. Well, bless God. On tonight, we've got special music starting out on tonight. She is. Oh, that's your part. I'm sorry. That's okay. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> She's not a, a, a stranger. She's a regular on Bodybuilders TV. Yes. She made her debut in 2005 in Daytona Beach at the Daytona Beach Conference Center. She's a wonderful praise and worship leader, anointed of God. Come on, put your hands together for Miami's own Zaretta Hopkins. Praise the Lord. Amen. Glory to God. to wonder how the scriptures could be true it's because you first loved us Lord it's really why we love you on today I stand convicted in my heart I know it's true there's no good thing I could have done to deserve what I have from you I love you Jesus with all to God I give the glory alone he made my every trial to be a stepping stone and if you look back to where you're from to where you are today how could you not lift both your hands and give God a crazy praise and say I love you Jesus with all my heart and soul Be 
with you. You, you promised never to leave me, and I found it to be true. I love Jesus, and he loves me too. I love Jesus, and he loves me too. Here we go. I love Jesus. I love him. I love Jesus. And he loves me too. I love Jesus. I love Jesus. I love Jesus. Hey, has he done anything for you? When you were down and feeling blue, didn't he make everything all right? Turn your darkness into light. The name above all names. On the cross, he took your blame. Overcome the world and set me free. Now I've got the victory. I love him. Oh, yes, I do. God loves you tonight. God bless. God loves you too. Special music by our own Zaretta Hopkins. As Dr. Chambliss said, she's been with us. Somehow I feel, I, I know we're live, high live audience, but I'm echoey. Do I sound echoey to anybody besides me? That's me. I'm just, I'm, just, I'm deep that way. I hear myself twice. Hey Amen. See, I'm, I'm that good. Your I hear myself like over. Many waters my voice is like traveling. many waters. Yes, it's, it's just traveling over and over. Right, that's right. Amen. Over Amen. Over and over and over. But on tonight, I tell you, God has been doing something wonderful. It is one of the, the, the scripture lets us know and tells us that if they could, the saints of old and the angels, if they could, they would be here right now. If they could, they would come down and be here right now. I tell you, this is a powerful place and a powerful time to be right now. The old saints used to say this, there's no better place to be than in the will of God. I tell you, as long as you're in the will of God, you're all right. That's right. Because when you're in the will of God, you're in the right place. Look at somebody say, if you're in the will of God, you're in the right place. If you're in the will of God, you are in the right place. And I heard another songwriter say the safest place That's right. in the whole wide world mm -hmm. is in the will of God as well. Mm -hmm. Amen. I'm going to feel safety in his will. Amen. 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 I love it. I love being in his will. Well, we have a powerful show tonight. Amen. Amen. And God has blessed us to be here to minister the gospel through the Bodybuilders Television Network. I don't know about some of you, but I was telling Dr. Chambers, we were, we were at the office uh, the other day, we had the television on, and there used to be a time, there were certain times of the day you could watch television and there were certain things on. Now I blush at commercials. I mean, some of the commercials that they just haunt, just the regular commercials, and we thank God for what God has given us since 2000, we started to work and uh, put our hearts into labor for the Bodybuilders Television Network. And uh, those of you that have access to go online, you'll see we'll be launching that October 1, 20 channels of faith and family-friendly viewing. I got a call from one, someone that was trying to log on this evening, and they said, I must be at the wrong channel because I'm watching Laverne and Shirley. I said, no. <laughs> I said, no, you're watching the Bodybuilders Television Network. That's one of our channels, Live, Love, and Laugh. And if you want additional information, make sure you go there. And if you're watching, why don't you go to the website, fill out the form, email us, let us know where you're watching and where you're viewing us from on tonight. Amen. And we bless God. We bless God for that on tonight. Oh, can you hear, can you hear that? Do you know just that quick, that could be the horn, the shout of the Lord, the trump of God? Just that quick. But listen, I'm in media, y'all. I have to think quick. I got to roll with it, man. I got to be quick. I got to be quick. I got to roll. <laughs> Some of y'all will get that later on. See, y'all will the get the grave start opening. We'll know the trumpet sound of dead no, and Christ arise Don't first. talk about the grave opening. I saw my, my, <laughs> my sense of humor hilarious. I was telling some other folks we passed by in the area that we're in. We passed by and we saw this sign, big bold letters that said revival. That's right. Revival is getting ready to happen. Revival. 
big, big, awesome sign. The letters were in bold and black and red. But the sign is right next to a graveyard. All these tombs and stuff. And I'm like, I don't know if I want to attend that one or not. You know, I'm, some of y'all deep enough, I don't know whether I want to attend that one or not. But I'm like, if you can have a revival in a graveyard, hey, you go for it. You can have a revival anywhere, anywhere, anywhere. Well, listen, bless God, on tonight, our focus and our theme is sharing about missions. The Lord gave us, and uh, we're going to talk about it throughout the show, the Lord gave us a heartbeat way back in 2004. We were getting ready for one of our life, our Leaders Institute for Excellence, a Leaders, Pastors, Pastors and Leaders Summit. Yes. That, one was, that one was in Daytona Beach. That's right. And uh, we were getting ready, and uh, back then, MySpace was the thing. Anybody remember MySpace? But well, MySpace oh, was yeah. the thing back at that time. And we were, people were contacting us from all over, and there was a fam person that contacted us. Her name was Agnes Williams from Liberia. And they wanted to come to the conference. They just really wanted to come because they appreciated the fact that we were teaching to pastors and leaders and teaching and training and bringing them together. And they weren't able to come, but we began to network, and God just built a close relationship with us, with that family, and from there things began to blossom. And from that was birthed what you'll be hearing about throughout the show and broadcast on tonight the heartbeat that God gave us for Liberia. And I want you to know on tonight, those of you that are watching, those of you that are viewing, Jesus said in one scripture this, for this cause I came into the world. Now, I'm going to say this because we're at a new location, new, and my, my excellent husband here, he's, he's my, say it again. my say it excellent again. husband here, has been my producer and I'm so used to him telling me, I, I don't know where I am. Can somebody tell me which camera to look at? Because I'm kind of looking all over the place. So if, if I can get somebody to kind of cue me, because I don't know whether to that's go. That's Okay, there, there I go. Cause I wanna, okay, you're over there. Yeah. Okay. I, I just want to know which one. That's everybody's camera. Everybody's camera yes. So I can look a little bit here and a little bit there. Okay, I know where I am on tonight. And I don't see how they did it way back in the day doing live. I mean, they didn't even have tele they didn't even have cameras. They just did live shows. Remember? And it was on radio. They went in and they just featured and did live. Wow. Could not have experienced that. But on tonight, uh, I want to say to some of you, Jesus said that scripture that for this cause I came into the world. Some of you may have not experienced it yet, but you may have a situation that brings a so-called epiphany in your life that you find out and understand why you're doing what you're doing. You're here for purpose. You are not an accident. God, you were birthed for a reason. If, if you are alive and breathing, there is something that God has placed you on this earth for. There's a question that you answer. There's a problem that you solve. Some of you are just to be at the right place at the right time. Recently, at the time of this taping, there was a... a, a all over the world, people were hearing about the, the gunman that went to the school in Atlanta, Georgia. And there at that time was a bookkeeper that stayed on the phone and talked through yes. and talked to the gunman. How many lives, children's lives, teachers' lives, authorities' lives were saved as a result for that one woman being at that place. And Dr. B, you know what? She was going to commit suicide. She right. contemplated suicide In before December. then, mm -hmm. but she changed her mind. What would have happened mm -hmm. if she would have forfeited mm -hmm. that right, took her life? How many children would have died as a result of her making that decision? Mm -hmm. Your life has purpose. Thanks for watching Bodybuilders TV with Will and Brenda. Our broadcast is sponsored by Bodybuilders Television Network, 20 channels of faith and family programming on topics which will maximize your viewing experience. GAP, Gideon's Army Pastors and Programmers. GAP is comprised of 300 pastors and programmers who are the foundation annually of the Bodybuilders Television Network and Global Vision 2020 Partners, people just like you who support us monthly. 
The goal of Bodybuilders TV with Will and Brenda is to evangelize through media and empower through missions. Empowerment Missions Liberia provides mosquito nets, solar panels, lights, and more to Liberia as it rebuilds after a civil war. In Africa, every 45 seconds, a child dies from malaria, the result of an infected mosquito bite. What can you do in 45 seconds? Save a life? Buy a net. It only takes 45 seconds today. Pastors, partners, you have 45 seconds. Save a life? Buy a net. Visit us at www.bbtv.com. www.bbtv.com. Or call us at 762 500 2025. 45 seconds. What can you do? Save a life? Buy a net. www.bbtvn.com. On behalf of Dr. Will and Brenda Chambliss, thanks for watching Bodybuilders TV with Will and Brenda. We'll see you next time. TV with Will and Brenda. Our broadcast is sponsored by Bodybuilders Television Network, 20 channels of faith and family programming on topics which will maximize your viewing experience. GAP, Gideon's Army Pastors and Programmers. GAP is comprised of 300 pastors and programmers who are the foundation annually of the Bodybuilders Television Network and Global Vision 2020 partners, people just like you who support us monthly. The goal of Bodybuilders TV with Will and Brenda is to evangelize through media and empower through missions. Empowerment Missions Liberia provides mosquito nets, solar panels, lights, and more to Liberia as it rebuilds after a civil war. In Africa, every 45 seconds, a child dies from malaria, the result of an infected mosquito bite. What can you do in 45 seconds? Save a life? Buy a net. It only takes 45 seconds today. Pastors, partners, you have 45 seconds. Save a life? Buy a net. Visit us at www.bbtv.com www.bbtv.com or call us at 762-500-2025. 45 seconds. What can you do? Save a life? Buy a net. www.bbtvn.com On behalf of Dr. Will and Brenda Chambliss, thanks for watching Bodybuilders TV with Will and Brenda. We'll see you next time.